Are you feeling all right, New York? I don't know if you can hear me over there. Can you hear me? Hi, my name is Maurice Kiri and I'm a musician from Uganda. I am from Kampala and well, was born and raised in Kampala and I come from a very musical family. Uh, all my siblings are into music, my mother loved music, my dad loved music, so music is something I've done for as long as I can remember. She danced all night, oh what a sight, a diamond ring bling bling and so bright. She when I started to write songs I was about 12 years old and by the time I was 15 I had understood what a song should sound like and how to put one and two together. Of course the messages were still weak and childish. Uh, by the time I was 18, I could feel that maybe I started grasping my songwriting technique. Please don't call this charity. It's all that we must play. I would describe it in one word I would say, Moyo, which means Ugandan soul music. Uh, some people would say it has a strong touch of jazz or R&B or neo soul. I would say yes, it probably does, but it it also has a touch of, uh, that's very Ugandan to it and I call it more because when I sing I feel like it's soul music just with a Ugandan flair. My latest album is called Misubao. Misubao means candles and what I'm talking about is that in life we are like candles and we have a time period when we give light and when we melt down and the joy of a candle is if as it melts out, it can give light to another candle. So I'm, I'm singing out to people to inspire the people around them while they still can and tell the people that they love, that they love. Well, there's a song on the album called I Will Sing, where I say as a musician, uh, I don't belong to a parliamentary office that I would have these, these uh, opportunities to change the world the way they do. But my way of changing the world is through my voice and what I write about in the music. I will sing. Maybe the world would join us one. Oh yeah, at least what my language sounds like. Lika lika zinengenda, ya ba imbi na gasi weda. Engule miti ma baje tuali na mbuvera ba puji di la bokalo ba bere ba if I can sing and influence people to, to live better and to promote peace and stay away from violence, if thousands and thousands of people are listening to me just as much as they listen to a politician, then I'll use my voice to play my role in the politics to encourage peace. What people will take away from my music or will learn that there's, there's hope in African music, especially in, in Uganda out there, a country Uganda out there in East Africa has got talent and art and there's the musician, uh, me along uh, with many people, we're calling out for the world to tap into our industry because there's a lot you can learn from the music that we do because we don't only just play music, but we talk about the culture, the tourism. Through music, you feel like you just travel to Uganda, you can hear it in the music. and. I'd like to just put my country out there on, on a more positive side and I like to use the arts because it's some of the strongest things we have in the country, our culture and arts. Thank you.